What is up, guys? It's Scott with Never Hedge, and uh, today we are talking about a new token, uh, new to me. I've been watching this for a couple of uh, weeks now, and it it is up uh, quite a bit. So I first um, was doing some digging on this back in the middle of June, right around this area at uh, 0018 to the 002-ish range. Uh, didn't do much about it. Ended up putting off uh, buying some until a couple of days ago. And uh, and then we are up quite a bit to 004. Still down quite a bit from all-time high of looks like 1.1 pennies we can definitely get back up to the all-time highs with the upcoming catalyst they got so what made this pretty compelling for me to go ahead and buy some last week over the weekend was their upcoming partnerships uh with so they did announce on uh the 24th that they are uh going to be partnering up with marvel in their in their VV uh, NFT showroom here. And then, so that was the 24th of June. And guess what is July 23rd? That's Comic-Con. Uh, guess who loves fucking Marvel is Comic-Con nerds. Uh, so you think they're going to be selling uh, some NFTs at Comic-Con of this or just in general? Uh, yeah, I'm going to I'm gonna guess that they are going to be selling a hell of a lot of Marvel NFTs. Uh, so let's get right into this, guys. Marvel plus VV. VV has been working closely with Marvel to offer, for the first time, officially licensed digital collectible products as NFTs. This is a momentous occasion for the collectibles industry at large, highlighting the innovative and forward-thinking culture at Marvel and further validating the new world of digital collecting in its and its future in pop culture and entertainment. Vivi is incredibly excited and honored to feature your favorite Marvel heroes crossing over into the real world via augmented reality 3D characters, comics, and more. Marvel fans can expect a rich collecting experience, whether it's an interactive statue of an iconic Marvel superhero, a secret rare edition comic you can frame in your virtual showroom, or buying and selling with others in the secondary market. There will be a Marvel digital collectible experience for everyone. So that's pretty fucking big, guys. I think uh, after Comic-Con, I think it's probably going to be hovering around... So you see, I mean, we've been pumping pretty good over the la over this long weekend here. And we've kind of pulled back a little bit. Let's go to the 7-day chart. So you see, we've been just shooting up over the last week. High of the week at 0047, and then we've got a bit of a pullback today as low as 0035, and then we're back up into the 004s. Uh, it's going to be pretty big stuff. If uh, you don't know, if this is your first experience with uh, Ecomi, so they do have the VV NFT Marketplace, which is big. Let's see if we can uh, pull up some of their partnerships here. They've got DC, Star Trek, Ghostbusters, uh, Powerpuff Girls, Adventure Time, Jurassic Park, fucking Superman. They got a bunch of DC comic stuff already. You got Jurassic Park, which um, huge, a lot of a lot of dinosaur nerds out there loving Jurassic Park, and so I think uh, I think Comic Con is going to be huge for this once they get uh, the partnership finalized and the NFTs up on the VV Digital Marketplace. Let's take a peek at Marketplace right right now. I mean, there's some stuff listed on here for. You know, anywhere from 20 to 30 bucks for the common stuff. And then they have ultra rare stuff like Supergirl listed for 370 There's some other stuff on here for six grand. I don't know who's going to spend six grand on that. But uh, I have been doing a lot with uh, the NBA Top Shot NFTs and buying and selling those. So I think this is going to be a nice addition to the NFT portfolio. Uh, there are a ton of brands and characters to choose from on here. So I'm going to be doing some digging on that. Hope, I'll try and do uh, maybe a, a screen record of of their um, 
of their marketplace, and then maybe maybe some buying and selling of some uh, maybe some Harley Quinn NFTs or some Adventure Time stuff. Who the hell knows? We'll see where we'll see we'll see where the night takes us. Uh, but I am super excited about Omi and uh, Ikomi, and I do think we are going to get back into the penny range. Uh, maybe not within the next couple of weeks, but probably within maybe the next three four months. Uh, as you can see, if you bought, you know, the eighth of June, you'd be up well over a hundred percent right now. Maybe not so much. If you bought up on uh, like June 25th, yeah, this is uh, this is pretty exciting stuff here, guys. I'm gonna be keeping you guys posted on more uh, Ecomi updates as well as NFT trades, buys and sells, things like that. Um, so that is just about gonna do it for this one, guys. This is gonna be a multi-parter on the uh, NFTs and all that. So as always, guys, please make sure you're subscribed to the channel for more updates on Omi and nfts as well as other stocks and tokens we like and i thank you guys so much for watching this far and i'll see you in the next video